What's poppin', Pisces? I'm Laurel, and welcome to Love Pisces in this mother sucker, baby. Join me as I read you, you all's lives. Thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, commented, subscribed to my channel. Baby, you already know I appreciate each and every single one of you mother suckers. Yes, I do, baby. And if you need to get a personal reading from me, make sure that you hit that description box down below and check out my website, laurelsmoon.com for any other magical purposes and deviation workings and things of that nature. So, Pisces, let's see what's going down. This is going to be for my sun, moon, rising, Venus, penis, north node, south node, and for my Mars, Pisces. I love you guys all so much, and thank you for all of the support, all of the birthday motherfucking wishes. I want you guys to join me at 11 o'clock tonight, Central Time Zone, because that's when my birthday is getting ready to jump the fuck off, okay? So, I will be giving out free readings. I also will be taking donation readings as well, too. But don't be uh, bombarding me with that crazy-ass shit, okay? People be asking the same questions over and over again about their old-ass Dusty Parton. So, we ain't finna do that, and if we start doing that, we gonna cut the line, okay? Straight like that. So... This is going to be for the next couple of days for my Pisces, you guys. I'm going to check on you guys first and foremost. This is going to be what's happening in the current. So catch the motherfucking wave. <sighs> Pisces, I hope y'all caught that, ho. So let's see what's going down for my Pisces. Make sure you guys check out my classes as well, too. I will be starting those July 1st. And also, uh, make sure you guys check out the memberships, all right? I love you guys. You guys are the motherfucking dope, baby, to my weed and my blunts. <laughs> so, Pisces, let's see what's popping. Spirit, you are welcome into this Piscean reading. You must sage the cards for all of my Piscean gods. All right, babies. Let's see what's going down for you. Um, this is going to be the next couple of days, like I said, under this uh, uh, full moon in Cancer and also in Capricorn. So, um, keep uh, 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 keep holding your bridges, all right? Shit might uh, just get emotional. Things might definitely change as well, too. But we can ready to find out what's popping for my Pisces. I did have an Oracle deck that was here for my Pisces. I was looking for believing my own magic. So, I want you guys to go ahead and put your girl in the algorithms. Press that like, share, and subscribe button. And hit that notification button as well, too. So, you'll know when your girl is popping as well. So, let's see. Here we go. Give me what's crowning, Pisces. Oh, we got the magician in this bitch. Pisces. The peasants are looking. We must see what the fuck they want. <laughs> all right. So, for some of you, Pisces, this could be creating miracles. All right. Turning water into motherfucking wine. This also could be making plans. I feel some of you guys, there's a lot of magic that's getting ready to take place. That's why I uh, said that one reading was some sort of alien invasion, something that could be very different. But I'm seeing a lot of you guys are seeing your power, seeing your actions, okay? The magician is the magic. So you guys might be utilizing a lot of things um, that could include magic. This could be fire, candles, all right? This could be charging your motherfucking crystals up in this bitch. This also could be showing your talents as well, too. But with the magician coming out for the very first thing, I feel like a lot of you Pisces have magic and awareness that's coming around you. All right. Now, we got two cards here, Justice and the Eight of Pentacles. So some of you guys might be putting in a lot of details or just applying yourself. I feel like there's a lot of things that you're learning. Some of you guys might be doing some new crafts or this could be different craftsmanship. All right. But I feel like you're getting ready to find some results. Some efforts that you didn't put into applying yourself, you're going to be seeing though that project and that result. Okay, so with this justice energy, this is fairness, balance, equality. All right, finding balance in your skills as well, your your magicianship, 
This also could be legalities, okay, truth or just involvements all together. But I feel like this is a cause and effect. Some of you guys might be dealing with a Libra. Okay, but the world energy here clarifying that. So there's something coming in where you're going to feel accomplished, Pisces, okay? I feel a lot of you Pisces are definitely thinking about um, as the world turns in this motherfucker, okay? <laughs> but I feel like um, this could be just you isolating yourself, um, but definitely taking care of your mental health as well, too, with this uh, Queen of Cups, okay? Doing a lot of thinking and soul searching here. Okay, this could be doing a lot of maternal work as well, too, or taking care of your children. So, let's see what else we got for my Pisces. We have the Knight of Swords and also the Eight of Wands. Some of you guys might be just shut off to the world. Okay, this could be in communication. I'm also seeing with the Knight of Swords here and the Empress energy. Some of y'all looking beautiful, fine, sexy. Okay, some of y'all might be taking care of yourself, getting your nails done, your hair cut. Okay, cutting your balls, whatever the fuck y'all do out there. <laughs> Not cutting your balls, but y'all know what I'm saying. Oh my goodness, the shit I be saying. You got the high priestess here. So yeah, very magical energy with this magician. And also the high priestess coming out. Moon making plans and setting them in a real direction here, okay? Some of you guys might be uh, set, setting new businesses under this new moon as well too. Now that we're coming out of uh, Mercury retrograde. But also, uh, it could be that for some of you guys, this is the truth that's being unveiled in your emotions with this judgment energy here of what you truly want emotional wise, okay? Because y'all already know emotions is just actions in motion, okay? So, you do have the Ace of Cups here and also the Ace of Wands coming in together. Okay, so some of you guys got some good news, some good information that's getting ready to hit your ass, all right? Now, I feel with this magician at the bottom of the deck coming out once again. This is that magical power, okay? Some of y'all might be on that uh, 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 Jafar, okay? Corella DeVille shit, but you also got the good and the bad, okay? So this could be uh, the good witch of the, uh, the east and the west. No, that shit. That's what I'm seeing here, but a lot of you guys... Are trying not to be um, blinded by what's happening around you, okay? Um, but I definitely feel a lot of magical power here. Some of you guys are conducting what works for you. Let me take a peek under here. Some of y'all could be dealing with kids, taking kids, okay? Taking care of kids. So let's find, find out why this magician is here. Feel some of you guys could be getting some sort of maintenance on your car. Did you see the chariot and also the five of swords? Right? So why is this magician energy here? Okay, you have the four of wands and also the hangman energy. Some of you guys are making some final decisions, okay? This could be within a family household, a marriage, cutting motherfuckers off, blocking their dusty asses. Okay, yeah, justice energy here coming out once again. Full energy and also two of cups. So I feel going down in the current. There's a lot of things you guys are looking at, analyzing with a soulmate connection, okay, or who your soulmate is. Also could be letting go of a Capricorn or just letting go of uh, whatever is unnecessary, okay. Straight up. So let's see, Pisces, what's going on. With your help, I'm just going to get a few cards. I don't know why you keep going out. Hey. So something might be going in and out. This could be a person, all right, or a feeling. Let's see what's up. Yeah, you got heal here as I'm splitting the deck. So let's see what's up. We got oxygen coming out once again. Right behind that is Leo, the sun. So there's something within your heart. Okay, this could be your upper chest. I'm also seeing something within your blood, okay, or your blood pumping from your heart. This could be also your spinal cord as well, too. Some of you guys might be straightening out your spinal cord. It also might be some things that you might be needing some pressure on, but we got heart flow here, okay? So there's a lot of things in your heart flow that you're either pumping, getting up, and going. We also have that Pisces, that Neptunian energy, baby, which is you. This could be your feet, okay? Also could be your fibrin, your blood, and your pancreas. 
and your lymphatic system because you know Pisces we rule the lymphatic system so this could be you know your glands um, your pineal gland as well too so there's something you might be cleansing or something that's definitely going to uh, connect with your your spinal cord and your pineal gland all right so I feel like some of you guys have the ultimate um, it looks like to me um, the ultimate combination all right with your third eye chakra and your spinal cord Let's see what's up for my Pisces. I'm going to have to put this motherfucker down now. Shit. All right, here we go. Bet you'll like that hoe up in a minute. Okay. Your partner, King of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, energy here. I feel somebody's playing mental mind games, mental tricks already off top. Okay, because I do see something going on with the crown here or the crown uh, chakra for some of you guys. Also with this purple as well, too. I'm getting with the um, king of swords. Somebody's kind of antsy or somebody just doesn't know what the fuck they want in their mind or knowing how to make up their mind. But definitely Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy here or somebody doesn't know how to sit the fuck down. Also could be with the three of cups in the current flow that this person is keeping other people, family, friends up in the mix. Okay, this could be children. Uh, the motherfuckers and things okay it could be some sort of party or some friendship that might be happening with your person i'm seeing with the nine of cups somebody has they trying to get some sort of luxury okay or this also could be just uh them wanting to have their way that's what i get when i get the nine of cups when i'm thinking of other people okay this could be food smoking weed okay whatever material items that they want this is that motherfucker all right cancer pisces scorpio also Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, energy here. Look at this. So, Pisces, I'm getting that, um, you know, a lot of you all could be dealing with an Aquarius. Somebody's rushing, okay? Or somebody is uh, acting very flighty, speeding towards you. Okay, this could be speedy motherfucking Gonzalez. <sighs> what the fuck I'm seeing? Yeah, and then you got the Knight of Pentacles. So somebody's coming rushing in, but then somebody is slowing the fuck down. I feel like um, you might be having a hard time seeing the loyalty between this person. If they could be at a distance or they don't live in your the same vicinity as you, okay? Somebody is speeding up and slowing down all at the same time, okay? This is some ass backwards ass shit. And I feel like for whoever this is, this person, uh, you know, is going in circles in their head about you. Okay, definitely could be dealing with a Scorpio here. You have the Five of Pentacles and the Seven of Pentacles as well. Knight of Cups coming in reverse. So somebody who's not able to actually get anywhere. They want to be romantic, but they can't get nowhere. Okay, they ain't getting nowhere. It's a dead end. All right. Seven of Pentacles, Five of Wands here, and Three of Wands. So there's definitely some sort of third party that's uh, entangled here is what I'm getting. Okay, King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Also, Scorpio. Somebody's telling some little white lies here. Okay, every time I get that with this uh, this white horse, I usually feel like it's some white lies is being told. Let me pull some clarifiers for this. King of Wands in reverse. Hermit energy here. So this could be a Virgo in. All right, this is somebody who's thinking they constantly trying to learn, looking for answers. They, I feel like somebody is trying to keep things private here. All right, three of swords, also page of pentacles. Yeah, so there could be some sort of information or somebody that's feeling hurt, let down, broken. Okay, this also could be somebody who's actually in pain or it could be an emotional pain or just feeling lost like a motherfucker. Okay, this motherfucker's a lost soldier. All right, a fallen lost soldier. In battle, we got the page of pentacle energy here, so I'm getting Virgo and Taurus Capricorn for sure. And I see uh, that there's somebody who's trying to seek some sort of abundance here, but they're also um, they're scared because you guys are in your essence here. You guys are in refinement. You could be taking pictures as well too. You could be waiting patiently, or somebody feels like um, you know you don't have enough patience. Okay, but you're definitely aware, or that your dreams are telling you certain things here, especially if it's little white lies. We got the page of wands coming out. So somebody could be trying to take a risk. 
I'm also seeing your person has a two of swords. There's definitely a stalemate here or somebody that's hiding a stress. Okay, so let's see what's popping. Scorpion energy here. Nine of Cups. Somebody's definitely um, overindulgent. I don't know what card that was that just flipped out, but yeah. We got days here. So days keeps coming out. I don't know if somebody's trying to wait some days or what, but we got night night. So little radios here. Okay, now listen. Somebody's pissed off because they're getting ready to see some shit in reality here. All right. But I feel with this little radio, somebody is um acting stupid. Okay. Okay, crash dummy. Fire Marshall Bill. <laughs> we got ear hustling and count. So yeah, some of y'all just need to keep counting y'all motherfucking money. Because the truth is gonna come out about this motherfucker. Okay, whether they crazy or not. All right, I do feel like somebody's um, persistent, okay, because you are a throne of gold, but I feel like somebody missing something. Somebody missing some puzzle pieces or some shit like that, okay? I feel like this could be a work environment or a work situation, too. You got debit card and credit card coming out. Yeah, like I said, concentrate on the motherfucking money because somebody's a sheep. They just follow any and everything. They just do whatever it is that they... I feel like, yeah, this motherfucker on the gas. Okay, so yeah, somebody's on that gas. Especially little radio. Her. And there's a message. So somebody's getting ready to send you a message or some information that's going to be coming towards you. And this also could be somebody like, oh, look, I'm at the cook out. Okay, so somebody could be with their family, friends, okay, the whole neighborhood. Okay, I don't know if this is Mr. Rogers' neighborhood or what, but we got war story coming out. So, yeah, somebody got a story to tell. That's been coming out for a while now and loyalty. So, I feel like um, somebody got something coming up, all right? Or some of y'all got some money that's getting ready to come up. But somebody got a war story. They're going to be acting all uh, extra and shit, okay? Extra, extra. Read all about it. So, Pisces. And we got a little pookie. Somebody didn't hit the pipe before. <laughs> <gasps> okay or somebody like I said who played too many mind games they don't realize you know how fucked up they are yeah and supernatural coming out so somebody gonna be talking about their child or their kid because okay, I did just see flesh and blood as well too it feels to me like every time it's, I feel like somebody gonna come knocking every time they see you um you know shining and shit okay they see you on some supernatural ass shit this motherfucker young grasshopper okay Somebody asked in the comments, uh, they was like, what's a young grasshopper? Now, listen, if you ain't hit to the uh, language and shit like that, you need to go to the Urban Dictionary, okay? Type in UrbanDictionary.com, all right? But, yeah, somebody is definitely uh, either in trouble, okay, or they just straight hood rat doing hood rat things with their hood rat friends, all right? Because you got hood rat here. This is Master Splinter, okay? The biggest, the biggest master of hood rats. And we also got Drip, <laughs> And I also feel like some of y'all like, bitch, don't fuck with me. Just stop fucking with me. Shit, people, if you keep fucking with me, I'm going to listen. Shit, I don't know what you want, but just stop fucking with me, okay? We got ball clap here as well, too. So somebody's definitely exercising their ego. Straight up. I love you, Pisces, oh so much. Let me know what you all think in the comments down below. I feel like um something is protecting you from dealing with someone, Okay. Yeah, you got power here. So some of you guys are seeing things and your power is saying, don't fuck with me. You're standing in your power. Also could be a union or some sort of union shit where somebody's trying to fuck with you. All right, this is a motherfucking bugaboo. I love you, Pisces. Let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.